not necessarily engagement, but uh, whether it's sharing, comments, uh, all, all kinds of things, watch time completion, you can go into nuances of it, but, uh, but beyond just a view count, which could be purchased, but much beyond just a view count. So the, these, the, the, this talent is, so online, in the online world or the galaxy of online, a digital star is going to have greater impact, affinity, clout over a traditional media star. In the TV space, you might work much better with the Shah Rukh Salman, but I'm guessing that a, uh, a digital star in the same thing uh, with a different nuance and a different storyline on online would work with much greater engagement. So with that context in the background, you're saying if you really want to use digital for its true strength, which is engagement, uh, slowly it is also getting to the reach factor, uh, but you may as well then employ these digital superstars in the storytelling and you're not limited by the 30 second ad unit because you're talking about TV which is an analog medium and you want to be in prime time and you want to be on the top three channels and therefore you want, uh, then your creative person will tell you you have to break through the clutter so you have to deploy a massive star and then you have to shoot it in South Africa because it's scenic there and then you spend you know 20 crores on deploying it because you have a superstar and you shot it in, you know for four crores now you have to spend 20 crores in media and now you've deployed it and before you know it I mean by chance if that went wrong you're you know 15 to 20 crores down the line and there is no pulling back uh, so whereas you flip that around and you can uh, in the digital space uh, everything becomes very modular let us say, and for, for us on, on online, I think it's a lot more about uh, not doing a sprint, it's more the marathon. And for me, traditional media, uh, the difference is a campaign approach for TV or a print campaign or whatever it is. It's very campaign, it's a very high volume, high decibel activity around a certain period, whether it's uh, even a month or two months at best. But for the online space, you can't, it's like you can't tweet once and then come back and tweet three weeks later. Nobody's going to come follow you. So it's more about the marathons. You let the hero content and then you back it up with a lot of hub content. And that entire piece would be, my guess, 20 times more engaging and probably, I'm not trying to undersell the pricing, but more cost effective also, certainly on an ROI basis. So you spoke about the digital landscape and it's more about the engagement and just not about the exposure, right? So there's something much more deeper. Now, Gaurav is speaking to a lot of youth, you know, through Ajax and through Close Up, you know, uh, and you have Jamin, right? What would be your one minute pitch to Gaurav? Just one minute, 60 second pitch to Gaurav. Why should he take Jamin? We have to resort to this to make it interesting now. Because we're all agreeing, okay, Gaurav. So, um, do you have, you had a media buying for uh, all of Viva's brands, right? So, in your entire construct, you have one or several brands that want to talk to the youth in India who are online uh, in the largest genre of consumption which happens to be music in India, featuring some of the biggest online superstars who have that X factor already with them, partnering with some of Bollywood's biggest music composers. By the way, are you an A.R. Rahman fan? So A.R. Rahman is headlining the entire thing. So you have Rahman and three of Bollywood's biggest composers partnering with all these digital superstars. You get a lot of content that comes out of this, uh, original content uh, and as well as a live show. And uh, all of this is interestingly packaged for the price of less than one of the campaigns and it's perpetuating content. So, <laughs> Gaurav is going to send it to us for evaluation. I don't think you have made that cut. <laughs> <laughs> That's why we did, the, did sponsor it last, last year with Close Up. The German Close Up. That's what it's like. <laughs> Uh, Munjal, quickly, uh, what is the biggest uh, difficulty when you're pitching new ideas, new concepts to some of these uh, platforms or networks? 